All right, what is up, guys? As always, welcome back versus Fartigan. Wonderful name and a very, very prime decisive. Um, this is actually a very good and constructed. I was gonna say a trick room team, but that's not really it. It's definitely Sun, and there's a lot of really good essence to this Sun team that really, really picks me off. And um, quite frankly, while Dainichi is a good lead, I'll, I'll be honest, there is not a lot I can do versus this. This is a good team, like, straight on at it. So, <laughs> to my opponent, good luck, have fun. Ferdinand, you really, really brought it. This is an awesome Sun team, and uh, while I hate to see them, I do love facing them. So, that's a combination I could probably try to get behind. So, I'm expecting Torkoal lead. Internet Explorer, that's not so much. So, Futures, th these guys run a Salt Vest. So that's never pretty. Um, we're not sending Rosoth. Basically, I can get myself. Um, first and foremost, he can always use teleport. And um, if I were him, I'd probably Future Size. Let's see. Skull, nice and easy. Shouldn't do anything, but can always get me burned. And if so, then I lost my re recovery from my lift loose. So, looking at his team again, Toxic is kinda nice. Minus. Yeah, there were two mods here that actually punished me. So, flip turning here. Yeah, which draws nice too. Maleficent. So, we got this play right. Unwillingly, but we got it right. Ew. <laughs> the unfortunate part here is that. Actually, no. This is alright. Because we absolutely force my opponent out here. And um, he has two switch ins, while one of them being Charizard. And he's not gonna bring the Charizard into this, he's gonna bring Slowbro. So we're quaking here. Because <sighs> I think Slowbro is such an easy, reliable play. And um, while U-turn would have been nice, um, I just want the damage. Let's see. <laughs> Ouch. All right. All right. You know what? We can do that again. Ah, coward. <laughs> Prince Suku. Yeah. You only get one of those chances, aren't you? So, all right, this is a Dianchi switch in for sure, and um, I mean it's not pretty, but I got I got exactly what I wanted, and I think my opponent really really stumbles here a little bit. Let's see, Hurricane that shouldn't do anything. Actually, did all right. Um, if I'm my opponent, like Diamond Storm is absolutely coming his way. Right. Stuff rocks. You could have solar beam for sure, but um, I don't need to take the risk. Internet Explorer comes back now healthier than ever, and I have assets because I knew and wished that he knew <laughs> I was gonna play this. So he teleports here, I'm sure. We've seen Skull already. He's seen my number one switch into this. We also know he has nothing to hit. He can get me Skull Burn, but that's about it. Um, but Teleport should be the play. Or Future Sight. Slack off. That's good, though. That means it doesn't have Teleport. Also means he's not Assault Vested, so he dies here. And I get a very, very powerful Dark Pulse with really no drawback play to. At least for now. I think the Stealth Rocks bothers him somewhat. Because Torkoal is only like a real spinner and he wanna bring that one freely. 
and Slowbro is, all things considered, a good switch into my offensive attacks. So I think he's gonna sack. That's not that shock bait. Should I assume this one to be scarfed? I really don't want to do that. No, it's a soul visit. <laughs> or at least it's chunky. Um, ooh, that's not pretty. Yeah. This is not good. He stomached that really well. Then again, Garchomp is naturally bulky, but that was too well. You can just be very much invested now, think about it. Let's find out. Earthquake. That's kinda nasty. Good play. Ow, oh, crit. I was like, damn, that did a bit on that too much side. I think I toxic here. I think Slowbro comes in. Or he just, like, goes for it. Oh, uh, yeah. Took it. Like a champ. Should I assume he's scarfed? I really don't want to do that. I really don't want to do that. There's so many poor switchings. Yeah, we're gonna try this. Um, this could be a very, very stupid play for me. But basically, it's how, yeah, he withdraws. Nice. He probably had um, to interact. Oh, you know what? No, we got him. Unwillingly, we got him. <laughs> what should it my play been? Like, I was absolutely considering sacking it, but shouldn't. At least not yet. Start pulsing here. And I think this means that shock bait is done for. But he decided to sack the Internet Explorer. Oh, which actually lives. Huh. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. I mean, he wasn't the salt visit. I kind of figured. Ah, that's bad. Only positive trait here is that it's only 25%. So let's make that happen. Thank you. So, Mystical Fire, Shadow Ball, Dazzling Gleam, or even Draining Punch, or Draining Kiss, I guess. All of them happens to me here. Sending in Cyberax, um... It's not the end of the world, but yeah, it's not pretty. He was probably sack playing this one too, so yeah, it's not pretty. God damn it. Let's see. Yeah, got me. Shouldn't do too much, but yeah, it hurts. So, I'll earthquake here, because I think Slowbro comes in. Hmm. Yeah, good. Damn, Thunder Wave. Sunny D. So we got the earthquake right, which is great. But the uh, unfortunate part here is that we are dealing with Sun. So, I think we knock him out here, which is... No, we don't. No, we don't. Question is, would he risk it? I don't lose anything by not attacking him. Strange as it, as it sounds. But then again, I don't want to be able to switch in again. So, we get him sacked. We are, in theory, dealing with... How many turns of sun? Like, minus six turns, maybe? So, let's see if we can stomach through that. Probably not. Huh. 
Like, he's banking everything on this as he decided to go for it. As I myself really, really don't enjoy this. Jurassic Bark, that's a phenomenal nickname. How many turns to hard sunlight in three or five turns? I just gotta try to soak this. Weather ball is gonna absolutely kill me. Oh my god. Take it somehow. Oh yeah, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Life orb. Life orb. Okay, look at my team. What can I do? Weather ball, sludge bomb. Alright, gonna try to summon a sludge bomb, I guess. And throw this Draco. It's not a pretty sight. 25%, even if I manage to live this. Oh, he didn't take the risk to Internet Explorer to get a free switch in. Which works for him. Even more so now that I'm crippled. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna take the risk, right? <laughs> there is no way I'm doing that. He can slack off here, I think. Scold. Can we live this? It's minus in the rain after all. Yes, yes, we took it like a champ. Like a chimp. Let's see. Yeah, three more turns. So, flip turn here. Because I think you're always gonna slack off anyway. Oh, he had rocky helmets. My mistake. Side shock. All right, cool. That's unfortunate and kind of fun. Um, I can't do it though. Nah, no, nah, no, nah, I can't do it. Um, can knock him out with that, or I can try and knock him out with that. God damn it, this is rough. I don't want to kill him. The kind of the point was of not killing him. Um, I am baiting switchins now. That's all I do. I'm gonna U turn on this. Um, finally killing him with Rocky. I should have assumed it was Rocky Element, by the way. So that's all on me. As there was no reason for me not doing anything. But to scalding and stuff like that. Tip scalding. Swedish for you. So one more turn. So we're gonna send in Nisalato and uh, pretty much force him to bring in Charizard. Which Hurricane will not connect well in this. There is a prin Prince Suku in its heavy duty boots. The heaviest there is. I, in theory, only need a chip though. Don't need a big damage. Hmm. Yeah, Dark Pulse is enough. Oh, you coward. You coward. You coward. Oh, you coward. Damn, I hope I managed to live this. Oh, you crude, crude man. Like Max here stream, yeah, max power. This is, this is tough. This is not right. We had a fair game. I was actively deciding not to Dynamax to be able to, uh, you know what, doesn't matter what I was trying to do. As of right now, we are at war. That was not okay.
But I guess we're doing this. Let's go. Let's go. If you can do it, then so can I. Basically, if I fail to deal with it, I cannot take a um, solar beam or whatever. Uh, at least I'm getting out of the Dynamax. By the way, that actually looks incredible Dynamaxed. Yeah, Max Overgrowth. So like I said, if I can just get him out of that range, unless I'm not able to live this hit. But I should be. I really should be. But probably not, but I should. I, I want to believe I can do it. This is rough for the both of us. But you, sir, snagged me of a very, very interesting situation. I'm a bit surprised, by the way, it takes so long for him to make up his mind here. I do know that I probably won't be able to beat this team because I lost Hydreigon like that. Here goes Max Overgrowth. Let's see. <sighs> we took it. Um, and with at least one more turn of... Um, of Dynamax form. Plus Sans, we have a special defense race. And a dead Charizard. So I probably should just attack him and just do um, a prolonged situation here. But now... He has two choices. Either he brings in his um, Venusaur to be able to um, out damage me. Uh, since he has a boosted either Giga Rain or Energy Ball or Solar Beam, or he brings Garchomp and just Earthquakes. And I should be in range for Earthquake. Jurassic Park, nice. So the good part here is that. Uh, well, there is no good part, but basically I can't do a lot of damage, but I can do some damage. Sleep Powder. Ah, nice. That's what you get. That's what you get. Boom. <laughs> no more. No more. <sighs> 75% and we got the best of it. That was kind of nice. That was actually surprisingly nice. I'll take it. As of right now, I don't mind losing. As of right now, Daimshi just brought it back. And um, I pretty much won. Oh, <laughs> coward. <laughs> For it again. You know, when you play by Smuggle rules, you're not allowed to Dynamax. So if you Dynamax, you know, rumor has it, hacks finds a way. And sure as hell they did. So, too far to go. I want to thank you, thank you, of course, for this game. Really sorry about this sleep powder miss. But then again, not really. And also, to everyone watching, as always, thank you for doing just so. I hope you enjoyed this team. As while Crobat didn't get showcased all too much, I wouldn't lie if Dianchi didn't do a lot more this game than done before. So with that said, guys, as always, thank you for watching. And have a great day, everyone. Take care.